Hi, friends, and welcome back. It's Miss Birgit again, and Gloria, too, has joined us for this book today. Today, we are talking about the emotion of feeling silly. Now, silly is a yellow zone emotion, and oftentimes, feeling silly feels great. We might have a little bit more energy in our bodies. We might feel the urge to kind of wiggle and move. We might have a silly, a fun idea on our minds that might have us wanting to laugh or giggle. Feeling silly feels especially good when we have a chance to share it with someone else. And sometimes if we're feeling silly and it's a time in which we're being asked to be quiet, to focus, to pay attention, to learn, to listen, it can be a little tricky. And we might need to use a tool to help settle ourselves, settle our bodies, and be able to then do that focusing. But hey, silly when we can feels great to just let it rip. So I'm really hoping you're going to enjoy today's book. It is called A is for Ketchup. It is written by Xavier Finkley and it's illustrated by Laura Garcia. So with that, hope you enjoy. A is for Ketchup. A is for Ketchup. So good on french fries. No. A is for Alligator with very sneaky eyes. B is for underwear. That's not really so. B is for bear. Look at him go. C is for milk. Is that what you think? Oh no, C is for cow. Boy, can she drink. D is for fish. Mm think that's true. D is for dolphin in the sea so blue. E is for nest way up in a tree. No, no, no. E is for eagle. How far he can see. F is for bug. Is that what you mean? No, F is for frog, all shiny and green. G is for castle. No way, no how. G is for goldfish. Do you know that now? H is for flower, all pretty and red. Not so. H is for honeybee in mom's flower bed. I is for ruler. It's short or it's long. <laughs> no, I is for inchworm. Little but strong. J is for peanut butter, sticky and brown. Totally wrong. <laughs> J is for jellyfish, floating around. K is for pocket. It's warm and it's snug. No, K is for kangaroo with jellies to lug. L is for mane. It looks like a wig. No, really. L is for lion. So furry and big. M is for banana, all squishy and yellow. No, wait, M is for monkey, a silly swinging fellow. N is for dirt, all brown and gritty. Not true. N is for nightcrawler, who's not very pretty. O is for moon. Now that's not quite right. O is for owl that hoots in the night. P is for feather. It tickles your nose. Wrong. P is for peacock, who strikes a proud pose. What do you think, Gloria? Yeah? Get into a more comfy place. Good plan. 
Q is for stripes that go up and down. No, Q is for Quagga, who is no longer around. R is for carrot. So good for your eyes. R is for rabbit. Please, no more lies. S is for nuts, so hard and brown. False. S is for squirrel, who scampers around. T is for insects. They crawl and they fly. Not. T is for a turtle, a little bit shy. U is for ouch. You better take care. Because U is for an urchin with spines everywhere. V is for poison. It makes you quite sick. Now V is for viper. So run away quick. Woo! W is for den. A safe place to stay. Wrong! W is for wolf, whose fur is quite gray. And X is for bones that help you stand tall. Untrue. X is for x-ray fish. Tiny and small. Those are cool looking, aren't they? Y is for sap, all sticky and yellow. No. Y is for yellow-bellied sap sucker, a noisy fellow. Z is for pajamas. Comfy, cozy, and bright. Not so. Z is for zebra, who says... What do you think he says? Good night. And with that, I hope you very much enjoyed this silly alphabet book. And until next time, take care.